Today we're going to edit some videos on video, which is something I've never done before, so give it a try and see how it goes. It may not go very well because the Apple computer does not allow you to capture the desktop audio when you're recording the screen, which is infuriating. I have very much a love-hate relationship with the Apple computer. There's some things I really like about it and in other ways I think it's the most infuriating piece of software known to man and that is one of those elements that just I can't understand it. Anyways one of the very few things I like to do on the Mac is edit videos. I think the Mac is very good for working with media and that's pretty much what I use it for exclusively, just about everything else I prefer to do on the the Windows computer. This is not the primary machine that I edit videos on. This is a laptop. It's an older model. I have a, a uh, desktop iMac upstairs that I typically edit the videos on. But I'm um, just editing on this video, f uh, or this computer for the video. So generally I would um, I would click on this and then I could import the videos from my camera but I have some videos already recorded that I want to upload I mean that I want to edit today normally I don't do very much editing generally I just cut the end and the beginning of the video off you know where you press the button on the camera and I'll put a a fading transition on there just to make it look a little bit nicer. I don't do a lot of editing because I just don't really have the time. It's kind of intriguing to me. I would like to learn some more editing at some point, but right now I only do this part-time. I still work a conventional job and that's on the computer a lot of the day. So I spend all this time on the computer at work and then I come home and I don't really want to spend any more time on the computer. I'd rather spend time behind the camera or working with tools or something else. So a lot of my stuff is just record and upload and I kind of like it that way. Um, I watch a lot of videos that I prefer to be in a raw format. I have nothing wrong with a, with a 45 minute video on how to fix something. I watch videos why I eat a lot, which is a bad habit, but it is what it is. And um, when I do that, I like to have a, a long video that's unedited, and I just watch it through the meal. Uh, every now and again, I get people that come on here and say, Ooh, you, 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 the video was a waste of my time, but it's so long. Well, you stupid goof, you watched it. You should have closed it if you thought it was too long. I mean, it's not my fault. I didn't strap you down to your computer and force you to watch the video. People are just ridiculous. Anyways, um, I know a lot of people cut the videos a lot nowadays. Sometimes, like, I watch a video and 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 the video is cut like every two or three seconds, and it, when they're talking, it's just like I can't, I can't deal with that. Anyways, so I got a couple of videos here. Um, got a couple of, of scam calls. So let's let's go ahead and start with D is um I I edit almost exclusively in iMovie. I have another program on the video editing computer called Move A V which I use when I need something a little bit more advanced than iMovie. Like it, it takes in different formats. For instance, when I do a screen recording it ends up being, uh, I think it's a .flv or .mkv, I guess it is, and iMovie won't read that, but the other program reads it, so I'll, I'll use that program. Um, if I want to do a voiceover on something, I'll use that program. iMovie has the feature, but I have never been able to get my microphone to input audio into the Apple computer. And because the Apple computer is like impossible to troubleshoot because you can't change anything, 
I don't understand it. So I just, whatever. Uh, in fact, when I want to do a voiceover, I have to use the Windows computer to um, get the audio into the video editor because I just, I can't understand it. Right now I'm using a USB headset like for making a call, which doesn't sound as good as the microphone, so I don't use it for voiceover. I'm using it in this case because I can't figure out how to get the microphone to work and it's too agitating, so I just resort to this. That's why the audio isn't the greatest on this particular film. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do a drag and drop in here. And then we have the video. And uh, the, uh, the camera that I had at the time is not the better camera, so the audio isn't the greatest. So what I typically do to make it sound a little bit better is uh, I go under, under here and I change it to trebles boosts. And then uh, that makes it a little bit better. So let's see. Somebody, somebody's calls are just absolutely bonkers. So we'll put a, a closure on the video here. And, uh, we'll call this one, what? And it's that, okay. So we'll go ahead and save this. It's going to freeze because I... I don't know, actually I don't know why it's freezing. I'm going to save it to a, a network location, but that shouldn't have caused it to freeze. Okay, that all looks good. It's Inherently it's only 30p for some reason. I don't know why. Um, and then we'll put it uh, into the awaiting upload folder. And then we'll click save. And it's going to save. It may take a little bit longer because the the uh, CPU is is probably under high utilization from the recording so it looks like it has saved okay so we'll close that out and then uh, we'll do a new finder window and uh, I want to check uh, the file location so we're going to change this to uh, awaiting upload and it should be at the top now I don't know why it does this but when it's not saving to the local desk it um, it creates this extra file this document which just goes into the trash and then this should be the video here okay so that video is ready to go so we'll go over to here and we'll delete that because we're done with that. And let's move on to the next video. And again, we'll just do a drag and drop. Normally the the videos, you know, they would uh, they would all show up in here like this, but because I'm not importing them from the camera, I already imported them before. It's it's showing up like this. Okay. In order to prevent your extended warranty from expiring. So for some reason this is recorded the uh video is verticam, so we need to correct that. So we'll rotate it to the left. Now it's higher stand and we'll put the audio to trebles boost. And then we'll change it to auto so that it kind of levels it out a little bit. And let's see what we have here. In order to prevent your extended warranty from expiring, I'm giving you a courtesy follow-up call before I close out your file. Please press 1 to speak to a specialist now. Or press 2 to decline. Hello, my name is Alexa with the Warranty Service Division. Okay. Can you please verify you're making model your vehicle so we can close your file? Yeah, let me 
me go take a look at it. Pardon me? I gotta go take a look at it. I don't remember what the model is. Okay, sir. How rude of her. Okay, so we'll put a, a close out on here. I guess we could put an opening on here. Nah, it, it cuts off the beginning. Okay. I forgot what kind of car I have. And we're going to save this to the same folder. And we'll start in the next one. <laughs> this is a funny one. This thing sounded awful. Oh, we don't need that part of the video. No, we don't need that part either. What a dead space in this clip. That's too... Uh, let me make it a little bit bigger here. <laughs> this stupid junk made in China. <laughs> Okay, so the other video just finished. This is a small video, it's only 14 megabytes. So we can go ahead and delete that. And that just finished, so we can delete this as well. Okay. And we have to um, cancel these other documents again. I don't know why they had a glitch on here. That's kind of weird. It's in a raw file, but whatever. <laughs> what a piece of junk. Okay, um. There's a couple of photographs that were kind of funny. I wanted to, to do a voiceover on those. Uh, okay, so now this video is, uh, or this is an audio clip about uh, why I don't like the iPhones. So we need to go on the computer and get a photograph. And I'm searching this in an incognito's window because I don't want to end up getting a million advertisements for uh, iPhones. In fact, um, what I should write is no iPhones. What is iPhones near Paraguaya? Huh. Okay. This is a good image. This will work. Just put this into the desktop for now. Have a smaller size boxes. Okay, I'll let her know uh, when I'm done with the video. Uh, 
desktop. No iPhones. Okay, so now we'll go back here. There's our photograph. And we'll put this in here. Uh, it always defaults to this annoying uh, panning. Uh, oh, um, we just want to do this. It's it's it looks like it's a three by four image, but that's fine. I don't care. Uh, and now we need to uh, we need to make it bigger. I think the audio clip is like 20 something minutes or no actually I think it's over a half an hour come on get get bigger oh, I'm gonna have to put it in there twice so here's the audio I'm really struggling with this one here what's the problem here's the um, I really struggle to use the computer sometimes. <laughs> Which is ironic because most of what my job is is to <laughs> show people how to use a computer. <laughs> oh, that's what the problem is. The thing is 23 hours. It's not minutes. Okay, that's, that's, that's the problem. Uh, so we'll just take this back down. And why is it like inches, several inches away from the cursor? I can't get it over enough to. Okay. All right. So now what I want to do is we're going to put a a fade in. Which why did this just go all the way back to the end? We're going to do a fade in. Yo, viewers, today we're going to talk about. And we're going to. Well, we could do that too. That's not what I want. I want to cut a little bit of this because it takes too long to, to start. And then I'll move this over. Yo, viewers. Still taking too long to start. So, uh, I'll move it over a little bit more. Looks like that's right about. Yeah, well, view no, well, that's not too bad. Yeah, well, view Perfect. Um, so let's normalize this audio. I did record this with the the good microphone, so it. I don't think we need to change the EQ at all. Yeah, well, viewers, today we're going to talk about why I don't like the iPhones, and it's not. Just the iPhone. Oh, I really think that's too much. Smartphone thing in general. I just don't like them. Yeah, we'll leave it flat. I think it sounds okay. Yeah, well, viewers, today. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. And I uh, usually the audio is good if it's in like that that range right above the line there. So that's fine. Okay, so we'll cut it. Th we'll cut it there, and in this, we're gonna cut it the same place, and then we'll do a fade out. This you feel a lot better. I did that, and I will never go back. Okay, good. Um, and in this, we can edit that a little bit because you can I hear. All right, that's good. We'll do that. Okay. So this is done. Why I don't like the iPhones. Okay. And this is still importing something here. The audio from the network area. Okay. Uh, what's this? Oh, we have another call here. Oh, this was an outtake. We can do that. <laughs> this is actually kind of funny. 
the dog um, farted as soon as I started the recording. <laughs> Can't make this stuff up. We're going to have to uh, amplify this a bit. It's kind of low. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> okay, so it's, uh, I'll cut this back down to a more reasonable level, and then we'll, we'll put this up all the way. And maybe we'll uh, increase that. I'm not sure that that uh, makes it better. That seems to make it better. Seriously. 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 Call that the outtake. Um, did I? What, are there any other videos? Okay. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Um, where was that video? I'm not peeping it here. All right, maybe I already canceled it. Okay, so we're gonna change the audio here. Um, with this camera, I usually just do that and it makes the audio better. Oh, why is it... <sighs> Come on. Okay. <laughs> okay. IP address hacked and corrupted. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay. Um, I don't think I have any screen recordings. We have... Uh, I think this was the video I wanted to... I took a bunch of uh, high-pressure sodium white videos last time I was out at night and I really have a problem holding the camera steady I don't know why I always film with the tripod and so it's not a problem but I'm mean, looking how blurry this stink video is it's almost not postable I don't understand what the problem is because I set the camera up in the car and it it's so blurry 
like this video well that well that one is in the car but it's not moving um I, I think i did we did all the videos of of the ones in the car because they were they were so blurry um oh gosh what was that sound well i guess the point is they're always blurry and i don't understand it because like i've seen people tape well, good dash cam, for example. You watch a video taped by a dash cam, and it's not super blurry. So, how is it that they're mounting that camera onto the um, onto the computer? I, oh gosh, onto the um, the uh, what's that thing called? The car. I don't get it. If anybody knows how to mount the camera in the car so it's not blurry, let me know because I can't figure it out. And there's a lot of roads I want to film the street lights on before they get replaced. Okay, so uh, rather than doing... I was originally going to just put all these in one video, but I think I would rather uh, do a couple of separate videos... And we got an audio issue here. The audio is super low, so I'll put it to audio, up to audio, to auto, and I'll bump it up all the way, and I'll do a trebles boost. Oh my gosh! Why did it get all distorted like that? Well, I guess the audio is clear enough. I don't know. I was gonna have. Sometimes you gotta save it, and then and then uh, like put it up to 400, and then save it, and then open it up again, and and uh, uh, up it some more. But it looks like it's okay. Why is this so small? Okay. And I, I don't usually watch the video like I am right now. I'm, I'm playing the videos back because I know these need to be cut a little bit. Usually, if I'm recording a video, a, a video at the bench, I just let it film. And then if something happens where I need to make a cut, I stop the recording and then start it again. And so I'll know to... When I'm looking at it in the editor, I'll see that break, and then I'll know to watch like a couple seconds before and see what happened. Uh, but normally, like if I'm doing a 45-minute video, I don't watch it. I just know to cut the beginning and cut the end, and then if there's any breaks that I made with the camera, I'll look there. Otherwise, I don't watch it. This one I'm watching because this is recorded a couple of months ago, and I don't remember. I don't remember what needed to be changed. So this is all just dead space there. It's not serving any purpose. I oops. I think if anything, <laughs> if anything, we can crop it in a little bit. Yeah. So we should just cancel that part and then we'll zoom in a little bit here, I guess can't zoom in too much or it get blurry, you know, grainy or whatever. OK. 
Okay, let's see if that's good. You know what, that whole segment serves no purpose. Goodbye. In fact, I think we need to just cut it so that it looks like there's no cut at all. Just cut that whole segment out because it's just not useful. Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, that's a useful segment too. I don't know why I was even bothering to do that. Zooming is pointless. Oh, well, maybe the concept was better, but it just didn't work. Yeah, let's just. Whoops. Um, I'm just gonna cancel this whole section there. I wonder if I have another clip uh, of those whites. I thought I had a second clip of those whites, but inherently uh, I, don't, I don't see it. And these are stuff. See, this time I zoomed in and it worked, but it wasn't working in that other video. Oh, this is a video in the car. In fact, this one's not too blurry, but <laughs> they're usually blurry. Well, anyways, okay. Okay, so let's cut that end off. I don't like the way that it ends. Okay, this should be good now. Here's some more that are unfortunately getting replaced with the inferior LED. You can't compare to brightness. This is so much easier to see by. Okay, that looks good. LED versus high pressure sodium. Well, these aren't street lights, they're parking lot lights. 
Hmm. And we're supposed to call it as parking lot lights. Okay. And now, uh, a couple of all these clips I will use, but I'll use them at a later time. I think we got everything that I wanted to do tonight. So now, um, we just go through all the videos and save them. And let it save. I don't know why that doesn't go past 720. It's the same photograph. It don't matter, just an outtake. There's no real picture there anyways, it's all it's really just the video, I mean the audio that's relevant. Huh. That one only 722. That's kinda weird. I wonder if the thing just got screwed up. I don't see any reason why that would have been no, this is ten eighty P like it's supposed to be. I don't know, whatever. Okay. It don't really matter, because again, with this video, it's the same thing. It's kind of more audio than a uh, picture. Okay, well, um, that's all the videos I feel like editing tonight. I'm getting tired. So, I'm going uh, to let this save. And I'm going to go to sleep. <laughs>